I am the citizen's delegate uh, for Slovakia at the Conference on the Future of Europe and also for the European Dialogue with Youth. I think that the Europe is kind of part of my life, but I hope it stays like this even after those projects are finished. I can contribute in some way to, to how the, the Slovakia is, is being part of this conference. This is a board that we're using uh, during the roadshow that we went to uh, during the summer. It's a kind of interactive activity for people that visited us. They can see the benefits of being a part of the European Union, which I think is really important for the citizens of Slovakia because they are always having the same question like what is the benefit even of being a part of the European Union and they are being very skeptic about us being part of this and whether it's not doing more damage than good. My role at the Conference on the Future of Europe is uh, gathering the information from young people, uh, talking with them and not, with young not just with young people, but also with all the citizens of Slovakia. And we, we did this uh, during summer when we went to a road show. Uh, we went to the cities in Slovakia and we talked to the people. I believe that many people don't understand how the European institutions work. Yes, it's special to be invited here, to come to Strasbourg, out of everyone in Slovakia, out of almost five million people. But when I come here and actually sit in the hemicycle and have the, have the conversations with the stakeholders and everything, suddenly I have this feeling like, oh my God, we are doing here such a huge thing that's going to probably have a huge impact, I hope so. I would say that I cannot imagine any other institution that will be able to, to actually bring the citizens in the decision making and listen to actually in, in real life today, today, to their needs. But now I will give the floor to Madam Holtzarova from Slovakia. I believe that only by having a discussion with Eurosceptic people we can reach them personally and reassure them that the EU is here for them. I held discussions with people that are stigmatized by the communist regime from the past and are not used to believe politicians. And why would they? People need to see that the conclusions of this conference will be implemented in reality and that it will touch our everyday lives. The EU needs to prove them wrong by their actions not with empty promises. Thank you very much. I always wanted to talk to half empty hemicycle. Thank you very much. If I reflect on the fact that 30 years ago in Slovakia we didn't have democracy and now after 30 years I'm here in the European Parliament without mandate to talk about what the citizens of Slovakia want is something so incredible and so huge. And if it worked, it's, it's the best project ever, I think.